What's up guys, so I'm gonna show you how you could get the hit it emote for free super easily and fast. But real quick, I am gifting tons of you guys whatever you do want from the Fortnite item shop, including the hit it emote and the season 6 battle pass. So if there is something that you do want right now from the Fortnite item shop, just subscribe with the notifications, like the video, and then go and comment your Epic Games Gamer tag and what you do want from the Fortnite item shop, and I'm gonna be gifting tons of you guys whatever you do want from the Fortnite item shop. But now how you could go ahead and get yourself the hit it emote for completely free, super easily and fast. So this is super simple to do. So what you're going to want to go ahead and do first to go ahead and get yourself this emote for free is just make your way inside of the Battle Royale main lobby exactly where I am right here right now. Now what you're going to want to go ahead and do is just open up the pause menu. This is super simple to do. So we're just going to open up the pause menu and we're going to click on settings. Now, when we do click on settings, what we want to go ahead and do is scroll all the way over to the right tab. So just scroll all the way over to the right tab over to where it says account and privacy. And now once you're at this tab where it says account and privacy, you're just going to have to copy a few settings that I show you. You only have to copy the ones that I show you specifically. So the settings that I show you specifically, just copy them. So the first one you're going to want to go ahead and do player surveys, make sure that this is turned on. Then you also want to keep on scrolling down and you want to go ahead and make sure that can receive gifts is turned on as well and then you also want to make sure allow cross-platform play is turned on and it should say yes if you do not have the option for allow cross-platform play that means that the platform that you are playing on automatically has it on by default so you're all good if you don't see it don't worry about if you don't see this option because some platforms do not see it but if you do see it just make sure it says yes then what you're going to want to go ahead and do next is just keep on scrolling down and you're going to see this thing called hidden matchmaking delay. Some people do have it at 5 seconds, some people have it at 10 seconds, just go ahead and make it over to 0 seconds. It has to be on 0. And then after you went ahead and changed all those settings, you just want to go ahead and click on the button to apply the settings. So this is just go ahead and click on the button to apply the settings just like that. As you can see, I just applied the settings. Now what you're going to want to go ahead and do is just back out. Now, we're about to go ahead and be done, but when you do go ahead and back out, it should just let you back out. It shouldn't ask you to apply your settings. Just make sure that it doesn't ask you and you already applied the settings. I would also recommend double-checking. Player surveys is turned on. You have can receive gifts on. Allow cross-platform play on. And your hidden matchmaking delays on zero seconds. Pretty basic. So now, just go ahead and back out. So now, we're about to be done. So what we're going to go ahead and basically do once we do go ahead and do that, we're just going to open up the pause menu and we're going to click on the button to select game mode just like this so we're going to go ahead and click on select game mode and when we do go ahead and click on select game mode we're going to click directly back into battle royale that's just so that we could go ahead and basically like fully save the settings so now once you do go ahead and come back inside of battle royale just like this as you can see i'm back inside of battle royale so now what we're going to want to go ahead and do next so you're just going to come make your way inside of the main lobby but what we're going to go ahead and do next i would just recommend real quick that you do go ahead and double check one more time because you really want to make sure that these settings are saved so that it basically goes ahead and works for you so just double check real quick player surveys you have your can receive gifts turned on you have allow cross platform play and your hidden matchmaking delay is on zero seconds i would just highly recommend just really making sure that it is basically good but now we are finally on the last step and we're about to go ahead and get ourselves the hit it emote for completely free so what we're going to want to go ahead and do we're just going to open up the pause menu. Then when we do go ahead and open up the pause menu, what we're going to do, we have all these options. Like we literally have all of these options. So what we're going to go ahead and do is click on the option that's basically called. So the option that is called, what do you call it? So the option is called reporting slash feedback. You want to click on that option, click report a bug, scroll down to the bottom, click on other, continue and accept and submit the report just like that. Now what's going to go ahead and happen is that Epic Games is going to go ahead and email you in a few minutes asking you what your problem is. That say that you had to hit an emote it went missing you don't have it anymore they'll email you back in a few minutes the whole process only takes a few minutes the service is super fast they'll tell you that they did go ahead and add the emote into your account and the reason why this does work is because what we did in settings they can't tell if you really had it or not so since they don't know they're just going to give it to you they're not going to tell you, you didn't have it and it didn't glitch out because what if it did so they're going to go ahead and give it to you they don't care not a lot of people are doing this so they will go ahead and give you the emote for free and then just restart your game come back into the game and when you come back into the game you will go ahead and have the emote for a 
completely free, which is honestly super amazing. So yeah, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Subscribe if you are new. Put on notifications. Like the video. Go share this video with everyone you know. Go to this right now. And yeah, guys, that's about it. Peace.